Hello and welcome back to another Geared Up Garage video. In today's video, we are bobtailing down to Portsmouth with AFP Transport, delivering an Iveco for, well, Iveco. Sit back, relax, and enjoy this one, guys. This is gonna be sick. So the plan of action basically is to head down to AFP Transport where we're going to meet up with Fred and Alfie. All going to jump in one motor, head down to Acorn Trucks at Maidstone, collect the vehicle at Maidstone, then me and Fred are both going to drive the vehicle down to Portsmouth where we're going to drop it off at the port and then all head back in time for dinner. Everyone, a lot of people are asking, you know, what's going on with Legends, what's happening with Legends. Basically, Legends is just having work done that we can't do ourselves, so there's not really a lot to film. That's basically where Legends is. Legends is just having work done to it that we can't do, so we haven't been able to film anything with it yet. Okay, we have moved out of one black car, and we're moving into another one with the AFP boys. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, dear. Oh, there's not a lot of room in this, is there? Oh, there's a Puma coming there, Fred. All careful. <laughs> Oh, careful. Off he goes. Thank you for flying past me. <laughs> Thank you for travelling with AFP Airlines. Right, where are we off to first? Greg's or Mackie's for breakfast? We have all set off on our journey, and as we're driving down the road, we've sat there and gone, do you know where we're going? He's like, no. Oh. None of us know where we're going. <laughs> we've just set off and haven't got a clue. <laughs> We're going, yeah, we know it's Maidstone somewhere, but Maidstone's a fair place. Original plan was, I was going to take it all the way. What, you was going to take this all the way to France, were you? Yes. That would have been a great trip. But then uh, they changed it. Uh, I don't know. Jeru was going to pick it up from the dock. Right. And take it on. Right. Yes, it's going to Sheru, this trailer. It's really cool. Hopefully we might be able to do a bit with him in the future, which would be sweet. Bring up the daff. Waiting, Proper daff. Waiting for daff. We have arrived at McDonald's to get that nourishing, nutritious breakfast. There's a couple of trucks here actually, we'll have a look at them. We've got a Volvo with a scale on. She's nice. Boom. He's got his Mackies. Look at Fred. Look Fred. It's a Ryobi. A tool for every job. Everywhere we see one now, <laughs> we just make sure. Uh, thank you, Mackies, on the A13. That was an experience. Yeah, can, Mackies, can you sponsor us, please? I promise we'll shout you out in every trucking transport video we do. Speaking of trucking transport videos, we should probably go get our lorry. Um, otherwise, it's not going to be much of a trucking transport video. <coughs> to Maidstone, gentlemen. What's wrong with you? King of the road. Yeah. Da There's nothing wrong with a daff. When Why grows, don't you like the daff? It's still in puberty, look. It hasn't grown its wheels to the full size yet. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, that's what... <laughs> yeah, but he's only got a mid-lift. But it's a full size one. <sighs> Not a mini mid-lift. <laughs> mini mid-lift. Cheers, mate. You're stuck in traffic. We've arrived. Ugh. We've arrived at PCLs in Maidstone. I nearly hey, fell out of the car. Place one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, Fred decided he was going to take alternative routes. <laughs> so we're going to go have a look while Fred gets the keys. That's our, um, what do you want to call it, load for the day? Are we, are we loading for today? So let's go have a look. So we think this is the vehicle here. Hopefully we're right. Yeah, this, this fits the bill. She's gonna be well jumpy. Look at the chassis. She's brand new. This vehicle is going to France, to Cheru, the bodybuilders, to have a reefer body put on for heat, uh, meat hooks and everything else. So we're taking it to the port of Portsmouth, basically to, um, to ex work for it to go for its work and then we'll pick it up when it comes okay, back. She's a 340. She's a 340. Make sure the lorry sound little. <laughs> <laughs> My poor Scania. So I'm really looking forward to driving this. She's a six by two. But that's not, it's poo zero over it. Why? You're driving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
She's a six foot two. Look at that. She's gonna be jumpy as they come. So I myself will be driving this down to the port of Portsmouth and we'll have a look inside the truck as well, see some of its specs. This vehicle is going out to Cheroux in France to have a very special custom built body uh, as it's going on refrigerated work. It deals with meat um, primarily. I have a refrigerated body on it with meat hooks and I will read the full specs out later that this truck is having done. And then when it comes back, we can have a look at it after all of the work that's been done with it. Right, should we have a look and see what it is like inside this brand new 340 S Wade. Oh, smell that? That smells like new truck to me. <laughs> Let's have a look, shall we? Well, here we are inside the Iveco S Wade 340 6x2. And she is, I think, a mid-spec truck. We haven't got the proper radio there. We've got the radio there. Steering wheel buttons, nice and physical. Plastic, the plastic is still everywhere like because obviously it's so brand new but this is a really cool truck i'm looking forward to driving this down the motorway and fred take it out first though because um i don't want to break it first so yes there's lots to we've got carbon fiber over here but you guys would have seen that in when we went out and did the gray as graphics video you'd have seen that as well that was really cool but yeah it's got electric mirrors electric windows very cool Climate controls are down there. Handbrake's down there for some reason. But you sit so high up. Like, I'm sat really, really high up. So, yeah. We are all pulled out and ready to go. Off to the poor. We're rolling, boyo. How are you finding it, Fred? Not too bad. Oh, well, that's the, the bouncy, bouncy. Yes. The unit will be bouncy because of the we have the fact we haven't got a body on the back of it. So that's why it's a bit jumpy if we're ever moving around. Other than that, she drives really nice. I can't wait to have a go on this. See, this is where she needs like some black smoke coming out the side. There you go, look at that. Rear steer in action. So we are gonna we are gonna have to make a trip to the petrol station or the diesel station. The, the gas station, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where I was going for that. We have to make a trip to the fuel to the petrol station because this hasn't got any diesel in it. So we're gonna have to do that. All part of the service. AFP transport, lorry movers, ex geared up garage content creators. <laughs> Fred with the old school lorry driving position, seat all the way back, but yet we're not gonna use it. We're gonna sit upright ourselves, or even worse, hunched over. And that's why all you old school boys have got back problems. <laughs> Onward, heading down the M20. She's gonna be a bit jumpy. <laughs> Whoa! Easy drive. How much poke drinking this yoke's got? It should go quite well. It's no resistance, is that? No, it's light. That's nice. Let's go. You want it to be rainy? Why? Slippery and slidey. Yeah, on the rear end. That's why. Oh, here we are, arriving at Clackett Lane Services. Here we are, drive. Is this where we swap over? You can have a little drive if you want. Excellent. And while Fred goes and fills up, I'm gonna get ready to take on the driver's seat. Um, I'm not nervous, but this is gonna be well fun. I wanna put the premium stuff in, didn't we? Here we go. How much reckon this is gonna to come to? Look at the size of that tank. That's a baby tank. Here we go. Yeah. Two pound 66, yeah? <laughs> right, let's jump in the S-Way and see what it's like to drive. 
Thank you. We'll be fine. Ooh. Some proper trucking today, ladies and gentlemen. Some proper trucking. It's gone red. Excellent. That means we're filming. <laughs> We've just been overtaken by cool solution. That's because we worked so hard. That's because we were, you were giving bad directions. I was. Bad instructions for me how to do it. Yeah, I was giving terrible instructions on how to use the phone, and now cool solutions have overtaken us. We're stuck in the inside lane, and we've got what looks like a daff in front of us. This is a nightmare. We worked so hard to get round cool solutions, and now we're backed up in traffic. And Unbelievable. Jay has successfully managed. And I've lost my sunglasses. Hang on. Oh dear. Do I look cool now? My seat's on the floor. I've got my sunglasses on. Do I look like a real dude now? Am I a proper Iveco driver now? Hey, um, I drive the Iveco. No? You look like Stingo out of uh, Fifi and the Flower Tops. Oh my God, I used to love Fifi and the Flower Tops. <laughs> <laughs> we need to be 56 rolling coal. Very disappointing. I know, hang on. Buckle up, Fred. It's about to get real up in here. He's breaking, oh, he's, breaking. He's, he's breaking, he's breaking, he's breaking. I'm breaking, we're all breaking. Alfie's Ooh. flashed me out. Foot, foot, foot to the floor, foot to the floor with a big 10-4, coming to a studio near you. Speaking of coming to a studio near you, we're gonna take a little trip back now to when I went to visit Dan and Gary in the studio for our upcoming new single. I'll see you in a bit. Yes, we are at Honeywood Studios here in Basildon recording my new single, Hey Tang for Charity. Hey Dan, how's it going? <laughs> it's just so good <laughs> for those of you for anyone that is wondering when you saw me walk into this building that was about six hours ago it's now midnight in fact i'll tell you what time it is exactly the time is there you go three minutes past midnight, three minutes past midnight and we are still here recording the hey tang song so this is a song that I've written, uh, inspired by some of my friends. And we're gonna be hopefully demoing this, well, by the time this comes out, it will be next week. So next Sunday is hopefully when we're gonna be able to release this to the world, the week before Truck Fest. So all of you guys can listen to this, hopefully, when we all go to Truck Fest. And uh, yeah, we'll give you a little sneak peek now. To the floor with a big tent for a radio down to his truck. So yes, if you guys are interested in obviously the Hey Tang video, any money we make out of the music um, that is done for this is all going to charity. It's going to a children's charity, which we will name next week on the end of the video. So make sure you guys want to support that. We'll probably start a GoFundMe for that so you can support us and the charity for that as well. And hopefully we want to hear as many of you guys playing this at Truckfest as possible. Yeah, it's only two weeks away now, so uh, it's going to be an interesting one. Right, anyway, back to the Iveco. Oh dear, we have got congestion up ahead. Not long now, and then hopefully we can tang it down to Portsmouth. I fixed the steering wheel position as well, by the way. I'm, this feels a lot better. Ooh. What would you make on my driving, Fred? Out of 10? Yeah. One being good, 10 being bad? <laughs> Fine. 11. <laughs> a generous three. Whoa! Wait, one being good, ten being bad. That's all right. I'll take three from an experienced truck driver. I'll take three. Tunnel, Devil's Punch Bowl. I don't know what that is. <laughs> We're going through. Tunnel Tang. Three, two, one, right? <laughs> We have made it to the freight entrance at Portsmouth. Uh, there's not much to show you at the minute. We did see some battleships and stuff, but my GoPro decided it didn't want to work. So that was helpful. Oh, someone's ringing you. So much paperwork we need and 
I've not really done this before, neither's Fred. So neither of us knew where we were going coming down here. We were just like, oh, I'm not entirely sure. So hopefully we get some nice shots of the dock. I go. I think we're gonna have to walk out. I don't think Alfie's allowed um, in with us. This is well cool. <gasps> there okay. is battleships. Okay. I see bye, bye, battleships. Bye, bye, bye. Top of a battleship all the way over there. That's pretty cool. Fred, we're gonna see some battleships. He does not look impressed. Oh yeah, we've got all these paperwork. Yeah, there's loads of battleships. That's your export entry. I've seen that many a time. You'll need your GMR. We need that in the front for the shipment booking. Put that over there. That goes over there. I know a little bit about this. I've never done it personally myself, but I know a little bit. Where's your GMR? Brittany Ferries, you probably want that. Then Sheru's stuff. We didn't bring any high vises and it's saying you need to wear high vis. We forgot. I'm not entirely sure. We will see how this goes. I have no idea what I'm doing, where I'm supposed to go, or even if, if this is the right place. So we have made it dockside. And I'm gonna try not to crash. Uh, right, we've got to go over there somewhere. Around there. Around there. So we can just literally just drive that way, do we? Yeah. It says stop. Yeah, don't worry about it. Just keep going. There's nothing coming. Go! Pairing it up around the dock. S lane, we're looking for. So that's L lane. And you've got the end of that, evidently. What, up to the end? Or? Yeah, go up to the end. Oh, I don't know. Look at really know, all these trailers. This is a proper bit of truck in this, isn't it? Bay 12. It's going in Bay 12, boys and girls. Or the water, either or either, depending on how good the brakes are on this. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. You're obviously going to put it back in the other bay, aren't you? No, I'm just going to drive it in here. Oh, okay. Just leave it here. It's not my problem now, is it? Drivers. <laughs> how cool is that? Old battleship. Jay knows all about those. Very nice. There we go. Right, so let's go hand this paperwork in. So happy with the same boy, playing sand I am. Sand this sand is blood. proper trucking. We're doing proper, proper stuff on Gear Garage. Love it. Very cool. Right, let's go hand some paperwork in and see what else we need to do and hopefully find Alfie and not die in a bit. Look at the size of that boat. We got some boat and some boat. <laughs> Fred, would you like a photo taken with you in the boat? You don't look like particularly happy, but it's pretty cool. Got a combine, big old combine here as well. I drove my tractor through your ether. <laughs> wow. Now we've got to go hand our paperwork in and find out what else we've got to do. Head on back. I don't know. It must be like that way. It must be straight on somewhere. The size of them trailers, Fred. Massive, isn't they? No. No. Pretty cool, though. Huge trailers. We made it back with AFP and we're in the Land Rover heading home. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please make sure you subscribe, you like, you leave a comment, check out the AFP TikTok as always, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.